Spend more time with y'all than my wifey. Gotta turn up for a power like B. Green's always showing love on IG. Yeah. 454 game and YT. Yeah. Gotta show love to my day one subs. They come through my streams and they chill just because. I got some shit that I keep between us. This content creator should give me a rush and I'm making a okay what's up everybody it's me ec rallo here with another video for 454 gaming and we are here to try to add two more two more hero cards to our collection i'm gonna show you what we have so far okay we got three four actually a total of four more left to get we got to get kevin durant we have to get kareem abdul jabbar michael jordan and a final a final mystery player down below and our collection reward will be in-game Wilt Chamberlain so we are definitely so close to getting that there is no point in turning back now uh, we got rid of our only two invincible cards that we had purchased actually we're selling everything that we purchased everything that we purchased just so we can be able to afford to uh, finish this set and I don't want to have to keep buying MT just to uh, finish sets at the end of the year I mean we're, we're like less than I say about 70 days I say we're about 70 days away from 2K23. So I say it's time to stop spending money on this game. So um, let's see what we can do with just selling off what we got on our account. I mean, I have, where's the collector level? Since I have 20, let's say 2,800 cards. I got 2,800 cards and I would say about 1,400 of them are, I'm, are unable to be sold. So that means the other 1,300, I'm estimating here. I say about half, I can sell the other half, I can't. So that's what we're gonna do. We keep dumping cards and buying the things that we want or things that we need. Right now we have 221 from yesterday. I mean, we started off yesterday's stream at like, man, I swear like 40K and we just kept, kept selling cards and uh, playing games and grinding. And before I knew it, by the end of the day, I was up to 221 again. I've been here so many times. <laughs> Uh, but I don't I don't hit a meal often. I really don't hit a meal often Even if I do buy MT, I don't buy no more than three or four hundred at a time five hundred at the max uh, But let's get to what we're doing here uh, in our auction house right now We sold our invincible Paul Gasol like I said and our invincible Scotty Pippen and this is what we made off both of them and after that we should be at what 750 we're getting close to a meal We also sold a diamond Jason Terry and we sold a jersey for 1700 Everything else is we're gonna send back to our collection. I don't like things in the auction. I like to put them in the collection until I search their price because their prices change. Yeah, all these cars, the prices is constantly change. So I search the price, find out what is what's going for, and always sell for like a hundred MT cheaper than what the other cheapest one is up there. Uh, so say this George, say this Kyle Kuzma, and the. I wanted to sell this Kyle Kuzma, and the cheapest one that I could find in the auction house was 4200 Well, I will put mine up at 4100 and I do that for every card. That's how I do it. If the cheapest one says 19 I just put mine at 18 and we leave it at that. Right now, we're at 761 I don't really want to have to go uh, sell any cards right now. I want to get straight to the point, which is buying another hero. So let's see. The most expensive one will be Mike. Let's see if we can get Mike out of the way now. Oh, 12 seconds left. That's too high. That is too high. That one has uh, some extra half badges added to it. So we're going to leave that alone. Um, I'm not buying these cards because I really want to run these cards. I'm buying these cards to lock in for end game wilt. So we're not going to spend for other mics that have extra, like another Michael, Michael Jordan that has extra half badges. We're not going to do that. We're going to get the one that's basic and that's good enough for us because we're after wilt. That's really what we're after. So we're going to sit here and wait. Uh, if this one doesn't go, we can wait on that, uh, that next one actually has a diamond contract and diamond shoe. So that would actually be better. Hopefully not many people bid on this one because it doesn't have all the uh, extras coming with it. But we're definitely, definitely, <laughs> definitely going to put our bid into 761. But we're going to do this with seven, with one second left. And hopefully <laughs> we get back at least 400k. I hope we get back at least 400k because we want to buy another card. Please give me back 400k. Do not do this to me, 2k. Where I find out somebody else bid 500. <laughs> Don't do that to me. Right now, there we go. Perfect timing. Perfect timing. Let's see what we let's see what we paid. We got back over 400K. That was good. Now that worked out. That was perfect. That's how we like to do it. Add to collection. 
we got 440 up there now we're going to go back in and the next expensive one it wouldn't be uh kareem it would be durant now if we could get durant if we can get durant for 300 let's say we get him for 300 140 i don't i don't know if 140 is enough to go and get kareem i doubt it but we definitely have enough to get durant and then we can spend the rest of the night grinding for kareem uh since i have 400 tokens up there i got two minutes let me show you guys i got 400 tokens there and you guys can see that over in the uh token reward market we can actually go here well not there right here we can spend 200 while wow, you can't see let me move this there you go we can spend 200 tokens and we can get a player from the championship team we can get a player from uh the warriors and it's not guaranteed to be a uh, um dark matter you know what i mean it's not guaranteed to be a diamond dark matter it's not guaranteed to be it's just, it's just guaranteed to be a warrior so we don't know what we would get for those 200 tokens uh but the, i only bought one you, you allowed five total i bought one and i got uh dark matter steph power within sold them i made like 30k mt and i feel like that was it wasn't exactly worth it but i can't say i felt like i lost either so i don't know i don't i'm not in a rush to do it again i'm really not in a rush to do it again so um instead of doing that i would think i'd rather buy a card i actually want i'd rather buy a card i actually want so let's go to rewards again and i don't want thorough bailey i had thorough bailey's pink diamond which was a 96 overall and from a 96 to a 99 i really don't think it's going to be that big of a difference i don't so uh yeah look at i mean it's not horrible defense it's not horrible speed and he can actually knock down the three and he has a driving dunk i mean the car is not terrible there are 25 halves is a little bit behind what everybody else has going on right now in the year let me let me move my image real quick all right that's good enough for me um i'm i, I don't really want thorough bailey so let's see what else we got there let's see what else we got uh actually hey hassan hassan whiteside is actually a card i wouldn't mind getting 99 defense uh 77 three-pointer give him a good shoe and a coach that could be helped uh driving dunk at a 90 how tall are you you're seven feet tall 265 with a driving dunk f90 that is worth something actually and the driving layup is 86 that helps because he has a lot of height 76 ball handle it's not it's not terrible i mean but i know most dark matters are coming with 86 or better but 76 is not bad and you look at the defense i mean instead of spending a thousand tokens i'd rather spend 750 keep 250 and i can still buy one of those other uh, packs and try to get a shot at another dark matter or something like that but anyway i, I mean from the tokens like spend 200 tokens if i want to do that but i think i would rather get a sign white side for the height I mean, only twelve thousand people redeemed them more people went for eddie johnson than hassan white side i think i'll go with a hassan white side over thorough bailey only five thousand people were redeemed that let's go back and see if we took too long can we still get our kevin durant oh we got a minute and 30 seconds left okay oh we did miss the first this is the one with the diamond contract so we did miss that other one we were talking too long okay <laughs> but that's okay uh out of all the other ones we got left i think we'll be okay i think we'll be able to get this kevin durant let's see right now it's at 279 i don't want to go over 300 i am going to go over 300 let's see if we can get it to at least 350 then uh if we could just spend 350 that'll leave us with 90k and that wouldn't be too hard of a grind to get back up to enough mt to get kareem abdul jabbar i mean you start me off at 90k i should be okay i can grind for another 10k and then try to start sniping from there i never get snipes but i do try i do try to get snipes but along the way of get, looking for those uh big snipes i do find other things that i can make mt off of so it'll be fine i know we'll get kareem easily 
it's these other two I was worried about, Michael Jordan and Kevin Durant. So since I was kind of worried about that, I went ahead and just sold my Invincibles because I know for sure that they would pay for them. And getting in-game Wilt Chamberlain, I think, would be more potent than having Pau Gasol and Scottie Pippen. Those, those are cheap Invincibles. I can actually get those back eventually. Okay, let's go ahead and make these, this bid right now. Perfect timing. I may have gotten sniped. Who knows? I did. I think I went two seconds too soon. Let's see. Hey, we got 132 back. Hey, <laughs> we got 132 back. That is great. We started off with 440. So that means I spent 310 on KD. We spent 310 on KD. That means we have 13 of the 15 purchased. So let's see what Jabbar is going for. We got one. We don't have far to go to get to Jabbar. I swear, if we can add another 70K, if we can make it to 200, we for sure, we're getting, we're getting Jabbar for sure. If we just get another 70K. And I have, with all these cars on my account, I definitely have 70K. But you guys get the point. I'm not about to get into that right now. Uh, we're just going to keep selling cards and playing uh, Triple Threat until we get enough MT to fill in the last final hero card, which is Kareem Abdul-Jabbar. And I'm glad that I went for the more expensive ones first, and I always have to get the cheaper one last. And it's gonna be cool. So I'm probably gonna stream tonight. Oh, I said, look what I said, 200K, I get it. It went for 211. So that's letting me know. Let's just get 100K. Let's try to add another 100K to the account, because 230 would definitely get it for me. And then that way, uh, tomorrow, this last card will be released. And we want to be ready to try to get in game with Chamberlain. It's not going to be easy, but we have a lot of cards for sale. And that's what we're about to get on right now. So uh, I'll be streaming later on tonight. I'm going to go ahead and edit this video and upload it. And if you guys want to come through the stream and chill, you are welcome. And until then, it's been me, your boy, E.C. Rallo, and I'm out.